Hi, I'm Matt Strizno, and I'm the happiest chef you G. Today, we are going to make the perfect mashed potato and steak. Let's get started. The first thing you need to do is wash, cut, and peel the potatoes. You should use a minimum of about 45,000 kilograms of potatoes. Now you need to boil the potatoes. Do this by placing the potatoes in a pot of water at a heat of 800 degrees Fahrenheit, which did you guys know is the average heat of a bonfire. Next, you need to season the steak. To do this, I'm going to bring in a special guest to help me out. Hi, Sam. <laughs> G'day, how do you do, Hello, Neverino? Sam, can you help me by putting some salt and pepper on the steak? I will do that. What you should do now is heat up the pan to maximum heat, which is about 40,000 degrees Celsius, and pour a small amount of oil, around 4 gallons to be exact. Okay, now put the steak in the pan and wait 1 minute and 45 seconds. Like this vid if you hate waiting for stuff, but patience is a virtue and a gift. But the only gift God gave us is now, which is why it's called the present. So remember to celebrate every day like you do your birthday. You deserve it. Now what you want to do is flip the steak and then add a knob of garlic and a garlic clove. Knob of butter, do you want me to change it out? Like my status if you've met a few knobs of garlic, if you know what I mean. If you love steaks, let me know in the comments section below. And don't forget to smash that like button. Baste that steak for another a minute, 45 seconds. Yeah, steak baste yourself. Once it's ready, take out the steak and leave it in a warm place. So my fellow bays, what you gotta do now is take out the potatoes and add some butter and cream to the potatoes and then season them. Now I'm gonna ask my good mate, Sam Kalamos to come in and mash those potatoes. Mash them, Sam. Sam, Sam, mash them. Mash, 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 mash. Mash, 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 mash. Mix olive oil minced garlic, parsley, salt and pepper to make salsa verde. Yummy, 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 yum in my tummy. Now it's all ready to serve. Fang it all together on a plate and voila! I paired this dish with an absolutely scrum diddly yumptious lettuce and tomato salad with balsamic vinaigrette. But you don't have to make that if you don't want. Delicious mashed potato and steak for you and squad to enjoy. Send us a pic of your mashed potato and steak with the hashtag Vim's is steak yummy for the chance to win a date with Joel's clogs. Thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Joel! Morning Fresh cuts through stains, grease, blood and tons. An emotion is a mixture of two or more liquids that are normally immiscible, unmixable, unblendable. Emulsion is a part of a two general class of two faces single called matters called colloids. All the terms colloid and emulsion are sometimes used interchangeably. Emulsion should be used when both phases disperse in continuous or liquids. In an emulsion, one liquid that dispersed phases is dispersed in the other. Examples of emulsions include vinaigrettes, homogenized milk, mayonnaise, and some cutting fluids for metalworking. Max morning fresh, morning yes, slay that morning, you freshy winky, fresh winky wink, kink yes, drop laughter crying, laughter face. Okay, cool, are we done, 30 J. Matt, can I have some toast too? Please. Morning fresh. Now it's all ready to serve. Fang it all together on a plate and boil up. <laughs> I've heard of this with an absolute scrum dumpless. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is that actually how it's spelled? Yeah. Is it actually voila? <laughs> I did not know that. What? <laughs> All right, I think Matt and Hugh's cooking, but they don't know I'm here. So let's see what happens. Oh shit! <laughs> that girl is a real. I've paired this dish with an absolutely scrum dilly limpious 
<laughs> Ready? Yep. He's the other side. That's right. Hey guys. Hi, I'm Matt Citrusno, and I'm the happiest chef UG. Now you need to boil the potatoes. Do this by placing the potatoes in the pot of water at about 100 degrees Fahrenheit. Next, you need to see. <laughs> To do this, I'm going to bring in a special guest to help me out. Hi Sam, g'day, how did Italy do, neighborino? Sam, can you help me by putting salt and pepper on the steak? I will do that. Now, what are you going to do is flip the steak. Now, what are you going to do is flip the steak. Now, what are you going to do is flip the steak. Base that steak for another one there, 45 seconds. Yeah, steak base yourself. Now I'm going to ask me good mate Sam Calamos to come in and mash those potatoes. Mash them, Sam, Sam, Sam. Mash them. Mash, 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 mash. Yummy, 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 yum in my tummy. Now it's ready to serve. Fang it all together on a plate and voila. Send us a pic of your mashed potato when steak with the hashtag Vim's is steak yummy. Welcome back to Matt's Kitchen, Kitchen Rules. Where I the happiest refugee, chef what? you, ref, you chef. Oh. Alright, you're supposed to do it again. What? You're supposed to go past the camera. Oh. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Hendrix! Alright, thanks for coming along, Tom. I'll see you in the next one.